Hello again, Crazy Warrior here and doing a review for the Smooth Q 3 axis stabilizer designed for smartphone and GoPro action cameras. Okay, I don't get paid for this review, I buy this product with my own money, so it's my own personal uh, opinion. Okay, so let's unbox this. I already opened it, so. Let's see, I can adjust this camera here, the GoPro. Uh, like I say, I already opened it and it's, I got instructions out. Uh, one thing, if you have a big phone like mine, it's a Note 5, Samsung Note 5. You need to take the case out because that will not fit in there, okay? so. Okay, so far looking good. Hold on one second. Let me see. Okay. I'm, I'm using my phone. Okay, let's put the instructions in here. Come in a nice plastic case. I don't know if plastic or leather or leather I can say coming packing nice coming with a strap for the shoulder strap coming with a hold on let me take this out uh, standard USB to the micro USB to charge the gimbal alright let's put the box to the side let's take the gimbal out of the package you see here that's how they look nice casing feel like fake leather but look nice with a symbol here Sayun okay let's open this take this one out Open good. This is how they look in the in the case when you first open it. Okay, so it's in Best Buy is a hundred and thirty nine dollars, so no bad for the price. I see all the gimbals are way way more expensive than these ones. So the way it works you put the phone in here first we all put it on so you put your phone in here okay make sure it's in the center here you can move it this to the side and put it in the center and try to uh, what do you call that uh, yeah, level it. You move this arm in here, up and down, to st uh, align it. Okay, you can see it's trying to get it in there. Okay, let me just, here we go. And here we go. Move a little more. Here we go. I can move it a little more forward, down. Hey, let me see. Here we go. Uh -huh. I have to be perfect. You see? It's looking good so far. Uh, okay. Yeah, see? That's the way you have to put it. Tilt it to one side, try to put it way better. Okay, let me just see I can. Here it is. Okay, now when it's like that, just press the red button to put it on. 
Okay, no, something went wrong in here. Something went wrong. Okay. Okay, let me see. I can figure out this. It's supposed to be. Okay. It's hitting that. I don't know, it's the wrong side. Okay, hold on. Let me let me take this out first and let me take the phone out. Maybe I put it wrong in the wrong side. So let's see. Okay, because they can be in both sides, so let me okay here it is okay so that's what it is you have to put it in this side oops sorry for the camera yeah, no. this small tripod so excuse my camera all right so it's like that okay you just put it it's a hard to put it down and go. The good thing too is don't want to come out. Okay, so it's like that. Okay, so I have to adjust in here. Okay, let's see. Now it's too far to one side, so let's just adjust it a little bit. Still one side, a little bit more. Go to the other side. Here he is. So that's see that's the way it's supposed to. So you just keep pressing the button and start on. So you going. You can tell it's working great so far. Let's try to jo the joystick. Up, uh, down, up, down, side to side. Let me see. No, I think you have to press one to side to side. Yep. Spanning. Okay. Let's go down, up, left, right, I should have left, that was left, and this is right, okay, and another thing, this have a, uh, an app, is great, like I say, but, the only thing, okay, let me see, I can get up, alrighty then, let me put this straight, and the app called Scion Assistant and Scion Play. You press Scion Play. This is the app. Then you have to connect to via Bluetooth to. Let me see. Uh -huh. Come on. Here we go, smoke you. Here he is. Now you go to the app again and connect to the device. Here he is connecting. You see the app. This app is great. You can take pictures, video, change the camera from to the forward. Okay. Uh, in the bottom bottom you can get the pictures here whatever pictures you take or video right now I don't take anything yet in here I think this is the best part you gotta change the resolution right now I'm using 4k 30 frames per second 
but you can put whatever you choose to and uh, I think it's in here you can do a cinema joystick um, joystick you got joystick in here but this option you can use it like you have a GoPro and you want to move this you see with your phone instead of using the joystick in here you can do so too yeah, up. yeah. this one my dog is okay up okay now they have a locking here so you can lock is it locking here now you you, you stay in the same place don't move then uh, I'm trying to see which one it is they do the time elastics I have a slow motion time elastics okay let's go first to slow motion okay Right here again. Uh, the printing started. Uh, you can see how it started looking. Uh, like I said, this is gonna be for my uh, smoke tree gimbals. Uh, it's an adapter for the GoPro Hero Section 5. So, so far, looking good. Coming back later. This is right here. And this is the gimbal.
coming here. Uh, they just coming upstairs to do. Uh, then finish the review. This is gonna be the end. Of the review. Uh, the gimbal, Sayum gimbal, work fantastic. Uh, for the price, unbelievable. And the battery lasts 12 hours. Uh, I got uh, no complaints at all. I use uh, those time lapse. I'm gonna put the video so you can see it. Uh, do a video too. So wait for that video and have a great night. Thank you. Bye-bye.